Good morning, guys. Craze Mishfan here. Going to be talking about the defensive tackle group this morning. Very excited about this group, and as I think most of us do, we have a lot of expectations for this group. Last year, as you all know, <clears throat> Michigan finished number two nationally overall. Top five in sacks, tackles for loss, and number one on third down. Awesome numbers. And they're obviously anchored by great players. Chris Wormerly, Taco Charlton, Ryan Glasgow, all NFL picks. Yeah, Matt Godden, side free agent deal. So we had a great defense last year, guys. And, you know, some people think, hey, there's no way we can do the same thing again. But, you know, I think we could be a top five defense again. Here's why. Rashawn Gary, arguably the top player on our team, the best player on our team. <clears throat> Dude's an absolute stud. You know, <clears throat> best player for spring ball, you know, which you guys might say not mean anything, but obviously we have tons of talent. If he's the best player, that's really good. And I would not want to be on the other side of this dude. He's fast, strong, insane athlete, guys. Y'all seen him play. Crazy. Dude's a beast. And what's even better, he has another awesome guy um, on the line with him. Maurice Hurst Jr., 275 pounds. Top pass rusher in the country. Very efficient. And he, he had a great season last year on limited snaps. Can you imagine the potential if he played more? Don Brown was telling was saying that there may not be a better end tackle duo nationally. So, Rashawn Gary, Maurice Hurst Jr., that's only two people. Studs. Chase Wienovich is back. He had uh, five and a half sacks and nine tackles for um, last season. It's not bad. You know, it's obviously hopeful those numbers pump up and he, and he has a good season this year. <clears throat> and we have my man. Who I like a lot. Brian Moe. Um, finally healthy. He had a leg injury, I believe, in 2015. Which, obviously, we never want to see that happen to anybody. <clears throat> um, Jim Harbaugh was actually uh, gushing about him. He was declared him one of the top five players on the team before a leg injury. So, before even the leg injury happened, he declared him a top player in 2015. So, I really hope that... Brian Moan stays healthy and has a good season this year. So, the question that we always want to know for our defense, like, can they produce? Can they do what they did last year? Obviously, this is a different group, but I really think they can. These four have the ability to set the tone, to be a base, to be the wall that we need for a great defense. <clears throat> Will they be a top number two again? I don't know. Maybe I, I definitely think top ten. But they definitely have all the assets they need to, to do that. And they, this, the group said themselves that they are going to be the best defense this year. And obviously, Brown isn't going to stop them. And Brown isn't going to stop any of them from thinking out loud. He says, never discourage, always encourage. Obviously, so our defensive group is very confident. But obviously, they got to produce. And they got to action speak loud in the words, guys. So, come on. So, look for hopefully a great defense this year, guys. So, our starters were Sean Gary, Royce Hurst Jr., Brian Moan, and Chase Winovich. You know, hopefully they can be a top five defense, guys. That'd be awesome to see again. So, hope you guys have a great day. This is Crazy Mitch Fan, and I'm signing out. Deuces.